So we have a 30-year-old patient with a low AMH of 0 0.9. And let's see what Dr. Shilpa here has to ask about low AMH. Usually patients with low AMH are asking three most common questions. Like what exactly is low AMH mean? So AMH is anti-mullerian hormone. Low AMH means that the egg reserve inside the ovary is less. Is IVF the only option that we have with patients with low AMH? So, depending on her age, depending on her number of years of infertility, previous treatments and the male partner, that means how the semen parameters are, we decide whether we can give a trial and try naturally. IVF is not always the option for me. And what are the challenges we face with See, these? See, the patients? main challenges with low AMH is you may retrieve less number of eggs in the IVF cycle, you may get less quality eggs. And even the success rates are on the little lesser side and abortion rates are higher. That's why we are just concerned about low AMH patients. So what is your take-home message? Take-home message is if you are young and you have a low AMH, don't panic. We can still try naturally. We can still try IUI. And uh, you don't always have to go in for IVF. We can try for some time before going in for IVF. But the only thing is you should not waste time if you are having low AMH.